Hi everybody! <laughs> I was not planning on doing a video today, not at all, but I have to tell you I just had such a blast. I was enjoying myself. I really, I almost laugh out loud. LOL! <laughs> because I'm working on a journal for a lady that now took care of our youngest son for the duration of four years. Um, and the school is now over here in Austria and whatever to make a big thank you I'm making her a huge huge junk journal and I'm really giving my best and I'm putting so much effort and so much perfection and then I just thought no, I can't go on not anymore I'm so tired it's enough for today and then I saw the scraps laying around and see the desk well um and then i thought i make a journal like without any measurements without thinking without scissors without nothing nothing and i came up with this one it took like seven minutes okay real quick because i was not excuse my hands i've been jelly printing so much it's only random pieces of paper see that Oh, that's in the way here. See that? Nothing measured. Just random any kind of papers. No thinking. No color scheme, really. Just what's on the desk. You know, we always do. And create with what's on our desk. Here's some script paper, photocopy, and the middle spread is a little hard. And then all the way back, to the prints, torn, not distressed, no nothing, nothing at all. Seven minutes, and I had so much fun. And going back to these again, remember these? Where well, we took a square piece of paper and folded it like from one end, uh, edge to mm -hmm. the opposite edge, folding once, twice, three times, and then with scissors cut random patterns out and then reopen it. And I thought, why not using scrapbook paper or like origami, which is already in squares? See that? And that's the whole journal. And then I took two different types of thread or yarn and um, and done. And I thought, something's missing. I mean, is something missing? And I took one of these. Paper clip with some clothes on. And done. Isn't that gorgeous? just wanted to, to share this one with you. I had so much fun. So maybe you feel like doing this. It's beautiful. And now we can still go back to it and embellish like we always do. Making tags, pockets, tuck spots, um, belly bands, whatever. Stickers. I just love that. Love that. And this paper, by the way, is my new favorite paper, and I'm trying to get it because I was receiving some paper for cherry printing the other day from Amazon. Yeah, I know, but I, I admit, I don't get much over here because I live in the middle of the woods and um, down in the valley, the, the next village there is, they don't have anything for me really. Um, anyway, the package came, I opened the package and there was a lot of space inside unused and they just stuffed it up with some like paper from the roll, packing paper, whatever. And I just had the top of the, the lid of the dust, uh, dustbin just to tear it away and I, th I thought, well hold on, hold on a minute. And I took the paper and I straightened it out some, it looked basically a bit like this. And um, and then I I made some I pulled some prints some jelly prints from that paper 
and it came out so gorgeous, so beautiful. I have to have this paper. Forget about the A3 format and this and that and whatever. And then still my jelly plate is, is the large one. So the A3 is is um, not fitting really good. I don't like it the way it looks once I pull the print. And now with this new paper. And this is the paper. But I don't know. It has such a cool feel to it. And printed on. It looks like... Oh, I don't know. I'm just in love with the packaging paper from Amazon. And then I... I hold on like this. I talked to my husband. Damn. Where's that? Here. I talked to my husband. I said, I have to have this paper. And I tried to look for it. And I put in Google. <laughs> I put, what kind of filling paper or packaging paper is Amazon using? And they didn't come up with much, but I think I found it. I know it's 35 centimeters wide and endlessly long. I think it's 400 meters or one. The other roll I found with 35 centimeters wide is 600 meters long. So I can do loads of jelly printings. Uh, one more thing. If anybody happened to know, uh, if anybody happened to see or watch this video, could you please tell me because from happiness I got these long time ago these wooden stamps and I don't know I do something wrong I have no idea they do not at all work somebody has a, an idea how I can make them work I even inked them up and put the paper on top and then really squeezed here and to get it but I never get a crisp good image so they look beautiful but it completely useless to me so don't know what to do with these well that was just like random okay so that was it guys ciao love you